If I didn't pursue experiential learning practices throughout my undergraduate degree, uh, I wouldn't have the opportunity to essentially um, expose myself in something that I'm extremely passionate about and, into, and to also get an idea of what kind of environment I want to be involved in. We have 1,700 plus undergraduate and graduate co-op and internship students enrolled and those students are working with community partners. Uh, they're also working uh, across the province, across the country. In four different countries last year we had students and gaining valuable experience that ties what they've learned in the classroom and allows them to apply it to that work setting and gaining those valuable skills. We know from data that those students' starting salaries will be about $10,000 more than students in non-co-op and internships. And so we've been able to expand this, the work integrated learning opportunities for our students, which is um, a really great way that we can provide our students with skills, but also those students are giving back to those employers and they are applying what they're learning and being able to support um, different projects with employers. So it's a win-win situation for both. I believe that there's only so much that you can learn possibly from a textbook and it's the experiential learning practices and the networking component out of experiential learning that will get you that job. Your degree will only get your foot in the door. It doesn't guarantee you that connection.